now that the leaves have fallen off the tree, it's the perfect time of the year to plant what we call bare root trees. And they're trees that have been grown in the field and then lifted in the dormant season or when the leaves fall off. So they haven't got a pot around the roots. The roots are literally very bare. So we need to keep those wrapped up in polythene to stop them drying off. So the next thing we need to do is dig a big hole. The worst thing you can do is dig a small hole and cram the roots into it. We need a nice big hole so that when the roots start to grow, they can grow out into the nice loose soil. So a big hole is definitely the order of the day. I really can't stress the importance of getting the planting hole well prepared. When you think about it, this tree is perhaps going to be here for 30, 40, 50 or even more years, so it really is important to get it right. So once you've got a nice big hole, what I've done is put two or three bucketfuls of well rotted garden compost in to mix with the soil and in the bottom of the hole, and then use a fork to break up any hard layers before we put the tree in. So there it is, that's a bare root tree. We've got all this lovely fibrous root that we need to get in the ground as quickly as possible. But occasionally, one or two of the roots are damaged in the lifting process. We don't want jagged cuts like that. So all we need to do with a pair of secateurs is trim off any damaged shoots. And from those nice clean cuts, we'll get new roots developing. And then we can put it into the hole. So just try it into the hole. And this is going to need a tree stake to, to support it for the first year. So what I like to do is to just position the stake beforehand. So to make sure that that's not going to damage a root. If you put it in afterwards, the chances are the stake will go through a root. So we can put that in, just lay the tree there for a minute, and then we can knock in the stake. So now we've got the stake in, we can uh, plant our tree. So basically we want the tree in to be planted at the same level it was grown at on the nursery. So that's got to be our new finished soil level. So we can hold our tree in to where we want it, get some of our soil, two or three spadefuls, give the tree a shake so that the soil trickles down between the roots and then a bit more soil, another shake and then we can firm it in with a foot we want the soil to be nice and firm and more soil. And a final firm in. And then the last thing we do, just to finish off, is to hold the tree onto the stake. We need a tree tie. We basically move this round the two to hold it nice and steady.